Oh, not yet. Now, where is that final mission? Over there. Yeah, he spotted me. Oh well. Come on, come back up. Let's see. Oh, look, another bottle. And here's the pathway. Look, Bentley, with all due respect, it looks an awful lot like a water tower. Don't be fooled. That's what she wants you to think. If we try to free Murray while that thing is operational, why... What, we'll have plenty of fresh drinking water? I'm serious, Sly. Of course. I do owe you one. The lightning rods around the prison are designed to draw lightning strikes away from the water tower. And giant attack robot. Uh-huh, yeah... By turning the wheels on the rod, you should be able to redirect the electrical current away from its ground wire, rendering it useless. Follow the lightning strikes to locate all five rods. Okay, so you want me to break the ground circuit on all these lightning rods so that a bolt will strike and destroy the giant attack robot posing as a water tower. That's an accurate summation. Okay, if he says so. We'll just believe him for now. Get clear when the lightning rod starts to glow red. That means the lightning bolt is on the way. Okay. I still don't really get this mission all that much. Okay, I think I get it now. I need to turn them so they're all glowing. Well, they look like they're all glowing now. Nice work. That lightning rod is out of commission. Look around for lightning strikes to find the other rods. Yeah, okay, I get it. They don't all need to be on. They need to be facing upwards in some sort of random direction. Okay. I think I get it. Okay, next one's that way. I'm kind of tempted to get that... Artifact now, just out of pure greed. Oh, and there's another artifact right there, too. I could have sworn I saw some exit point, some little thing I could break to get outside. And I do hear a bottle, too. Right there. No, I wanted the bottle. Well, how do I get out of here? I think I'm stuck. No, wait, here we go. Get this bottle first. And find our exit. There should be one along the wall. There we go. Okay, now where are the lightning strikes? They must be on the other side of the compound. Oh well. Yep, this way. I just saw it in the sky. Let's 
somewhere near here. I think that one might be it. Just need to get up there. So I need to turn it so that one right there is facing up. Ow. There we go. Three more of these to go. Great. Don't tell me that's inside the compound. I was just there. That's how they're going to do it, huh? Very time-consuming. Back and forth. One hell of a jump by a sly. Only there was an easier way in there. Oh, this works. There needs to be more entrance points in this, though. Now, where was that lightning strike at? That way. Course. Actually, they might have been outside. Because this is where Sly broke out. And there's yet another bottle. So where are the lightning strikes coming from? Okay, maybe they're not right here. Maybe they are in. Okay, they're right there. They are inside. This game is starting to play tricks with my mind. Because now I'm going to have to find some other way back in. Going after another bottle. Wait, I just saw the lightning strike. And it's not outside. Unless that's a completely different one. Which it could potentially be. And if that's the case, then that means that my assumption that I had to go from one to the next in a specific order was completely wrong. They're actually shooting them all. Get out of there. So as long as I jump, I'm fine. Okay, good to know. A little late, but good to know now. Okay, that goes over here. Oh, I thought I jumped in time. Okay, two left. I think I just saw one over there. And where's the final one? One right there. And I really don't want to go in the compound just yet if there's one out here. Well, that's the only lightning flash I'm seeing. Nope, they're both inside. Alrighty then. No, into the water. And surprisingly, it's not a death. 
Don't know how I survived that. I mean, I don't even have one HP. I have like half of a health point. Careful. Health, please. Ah, why didn't you give me health? I need it. I'm gonna die. Okay, now I'm dead. What's odd is that I could have sworn I pressed circle at the right time. So I should have been on that one little platform. Again I pressed circle. What's wrong? Huh. Twice in a row I press circle and I don't land on the platform I'm aiming for. Well, anyways, there's one of the things I need to break. Yet yeah, now I get health. Figures. And again, what the hell is going on? I'm pressing circle to land on that platform. I should be landing on it, but no, it brings me all the way down here to the rope. That is some bowl. See that thing right there? It's shining. I should be able to jump on top of it. The second time, I try jumping on it, and it brings me to the rope below. One of the major problems of automatic jumping Now, how am I going to get up there? There don't seem to be any wires leading up there. Wait, hold on. There's one right there. Tricky. Stay out of the way. Damn it. Jump to avoid lightning. End up falling on the ground. I guess I'm being too close even if I am jumping. Alright, one more, and I think it's on the other side. Oh, might as well go this way. I might encounter a couple more bottles. No bottles so far. No, no, no! Bloody hell! What the? F mm. Damn you, sucker punch, and your automatic landings! It is never 100% accurate. That's why I hate it sometimes. I'm aiming for one platform, and it brings me to another one. Bad prediction skills on the AI. And screw it, I'm skipping ahead. Uh, well, there's a bottle right there. Might as well get that. Alright, now let's try this again. There we go. I don't know, sometimes the game is just awkward like that. It thinks you want to go on one platform when you really don't. Come on, spin it. There we go, all five. Like I said, giant attack robot! Alright, I'll give one to him. I'll give one to Bentley, he was right.